This weekend is upon us, bringing with it big boats and a lot of art. That's right, but changes to what we're all used to might bring some added frustration to all the fun. CBS 4's Joan Murray is live in Miami with what we all need to know. Joan. Well, it's all about the location. Now, we are at um, one of the events of the Big Boat Show near Bayfront. And this is where you can find all the sailboats. But the big problem is south of here on Virginia Key, where they have moved the main location of the show. It means big traffic on a big weekend. The sign on 95 says it all. Expect delays. It took us an hour to navigate the traffic to Virginia Key, the new main location of the Miami International Boat Show. That's why the mayor is urging everyone to do what he did, take a water taxi. One, two, three. Yeah. The boat show is in the iconic Miami Marine Stadium Park. The stadium is undergoing renovation. Well, the fact that uh, the Miami International Boat Show is here is helping us to market this place and is helping us with the money. Uh, they're paying us uh, a big rent that we are going to be using for the renovation of the Miami Marine Stadium. There are hundreds of boats to see, including the super liner of yachts, the six and a half million dollar Marlow Explorer, complete with its own gym. These two couples give the show high marks. Yeah, I'd give it a nine out of 10. <laughs> but give yourself a lot of time to get here and get back. So you give the event a nine and you give the parking transportation what? <laughs> Four or five. Yeah. Four or five? Yeah. That's being generous. Yeah. Marlins Park is selling parking for five dollars, so it's a very reasonable price. You can get a shuttle bus right from there. And let us bring you across the, across the causeway into the show. You won't be able to avoid the traffic wherever you are headed this weekend. The big yachts are on Miami Beach. And if you are into the arts, you can check out Art Wynwood or the Coconut Grove Arts Festival, showcasing the works of hundreds of artists from all around the world. With all three mega events happening at once, within miles of each other, you want to be prepared before you hit the road. But whether you are in the mood for a boat, some art, good food, or just enjoying the outdoors, pack your patience, it will be worth it. And one under other reminder, the boat show is off limits if you're in a private boat over there on Virginia Key. So this is Strictly Sail. It is at Bayfront. And if you want more information on where all these events are located, including the cost to get in and your best bet for transportation if you don't want to drive and you were urged not to drive, go to CBSMiami.com. In Miami tonight, Joan Murray, CBS4 News.